And this topic we're going to go over is electrolytes. Okay, so that's what we're going to be talking about. It's definitely the potassium. Potassium is very important. You have to know everything of all the electrolytes that's in our body. If you don't know potassium, I'm a little worried because you need to know this guy. So let's dive down into the electrolyte real quick. First of all, let's talk about what potassium is. What are electrolytes that's responsible for measure of potential in our body? It's can for our heart. So the potassium pumps are constantly running in our body to get the electric neutrality between cells, all that good stuff. But we're going to stay clinical. So what is the normal potassium? Normal potassium in our body, which is extremely important that you know that, the normal values usually run between 3.5 to 5.0. I extremely sure recommend you remember that number, especially when you're going to be tested on it. If you're in the hospital, it's going to be chart. But this is usually what a uh, normal body potassium runs around. We need most of the potassium in our body. Usually they're inside the cell, right? If you remember your basic physiology, if I take a little cell here, most of the cells inside contains a lot of potassium. And on the outside, a lot of sodium. So that's why you have about 3.5 to 5.0 potassium inside each cell. Around 140 sodium outside the cell. 